Good morning. Good morning, y'all. My, my hair looks so crazy because I am literally about to go get it done. So I have, is my agenda really that big today? I don't really know, but mm, I guess kind of, but not really. So let me tell y'all what I got to do today. So basically I have to stop by my post box because I have not been by there since I set my post box up and I told y'all I got a post box. I've been putting it in the description of my bios. Um, also, a lot of people tell me they was trying to use my Amazon link to purchase stuff. Girl, that was my fault because literally, I guess the link I was using to hook everything up wasn't working and I wasn't paying attention. So, that wasn't working. But now it should be working. I had to put my hair because it was really in my way. Also, oh my God, the man came by and fixed my tub. Girl, fine. Okay, let me, let me get to business. You tell y'all really with tea. That's what I need to do. I'm sitting here doing the most. Okay, so listen. Game plan for today. Game plan for today. Well, actually, let me start over. So I came back yesterday, and I really, really, really enjoyed myself. Miami was such a vibe. It was definitely needed. I think it was definitely thoughtful, and it was super duper fun. And, you know, I love a little quick trip. So it was definitely given. It gave me exactly what I needed to reset me and make me prepared for the week. So that. Now, today I do have quite a bit of things to do. I would like to, um, number one, go order my bed. So I'm going to go to Ashley Furniture's today if I can make it there before they close. I also would like to go by Home Depot because I ordered my wood panels that I showed you guys. They're supposed to be delivered today. These panels, they're supposed to be delivered today. So I will be getting the wood panels put in um, probably tomorrow because y'all know my best friend comes. When I get a bunch of stuff for us to do, we come over and we do some stuff. So I'm probably going to do my wood panels. And then also I would like to do that abstract art I've been seeing people do, hence here. Um, I want to do some stuff like that because I do have... Let me show y'all. So I got these things from out of Hobby Lobby when it was Christmas time. And they only ended up being like a dollar or two. I knew I didn't want to keep this actual picture, but I love the canvas of it. So I'm probably going to tape the canvas and then just cover this over with something and make like really, really cool abstract art. I'm super excited for that. So I'm going to try to do that. Also, I'm filming with Miel today. So I will be getting my hair done. Um, that'll be super, you know, cool to do. And I think that's pretty much it, which is still kind of a lot. So that's what I got to do. And then this weekend I will be filming YouTube videos. So I have to prep to do that. And then I need to get a vent for that as well. So, um, yeah, I have a, quite a bit of stuff to do. I don't know why I was acting like I didn't. I really do. Never mind. So... That's a lot of stuff. So I gotta write my little list and stuff and get all that done. So I can make sure all that is completed. And yeah. Yeah. Oh, and then also, I was telling y'all, my tub got fixed. So, I've been cleaning that, like, pretty much all day. So, yeah, your girl has been pretty active, little baby. But it's been worth it because... Yeah. Oh, and then also, I was telling y'all, my tub got fixed. So, I've been cleaning that, like, pretty much all day. So, yeah, your girl has been pretty active, little baby. But it's been worth it because...
Honey, I just pulled over here. Am I the only person when I go to my hair appointments? I make sure I'm exactly on time. I feel like hairstylists sometimes, I don't think Nia will, but I'm saying hairstylists sometimes, they do be irritated that somebody is like early. So baby, I don't come early. <laughs> I always make sure I'm on time. But we're gonna see. And I got a therapy session today, so we're gonna see how this play out. But I back. Mm, I look better than. Let me get my phone out. Because the hair is pressed. Y'all see it? Yum yum. Uh, so I'm actually really glad I ended up getting my hair done. I'm thinking about filming tomorrow, but I have to go to the Mercedes-Benz dealership, so I might have to reschedule um, my appointment for my truck. I might make it do what it do. I don't know. I might do it tomorrow. I might not. It depends on how I feel when I wake up, because um, I do need to get all that done, and I also need to put my wood up, and I just got quite a bit of things to do, so... We'll see where I'm at with it, to be honest, but period. But right now, I just tried this new restaurant. My hairstylist recommended to me it was called Wok Chai. If y'all know some really good Chinese spots in um, Atlanta, let me know. And I'm talking about like, little carryout spots, you know, because I want some good Chinese. I know in LA, I never got good Chinese food, like ever. So that's what I want. What the f Why do they keep like busting around and driving around anyway so yeah just let me freaking know and i'm just waiting on my food she said it should be at like 20 minutes so we'll see okay so i got my stuff here so this is the general toast chicken i got it looks super good it is really red i've never really had it that red before have y'all and then here's my shrimp fried rice some of y'all this stuff I'm like an emotional eater, so when I be like feeling some type of way about something, then I just eat. But here's the chicken, and then we got the rice. They gave me two boxes of white rice, which I didn't ask for, but whatever. So let's try the general toast chicken. Let me grab another little piece so I can be honest about how I feel. But a little white rice. I feel like this general toast chicken is a hit. It's super good. Like super, super good. Mm-hmm, really good. Then I ended up getting a lemonade from them. Well, they had ice tea, so I ended up getting a half a half, but. Very good, very sweet. Okay, I'm surprised, because at first nobody really was in there, but once I was in there ordering, uh, people kept coming in, but it was giving good. But the rice with the shrimp is actually good. But just having it now. You know, I even just had some rice before and it's like really good. It's not like horrible at all. But it's not like, oh my God, I'm going crazy over it. But I could order it again. Definitely. And this is the chicken and broccoli. Hmm. Why do I really feel like about this? Um, it's okay. I will give it like a six out of ten. Probably my least, babe. This is my second favorite, the streamer rice. 
And I would give this a, like an eight, a seven and a half. Mm-hmm. For this, this dinner toast, oh, she eats down, honey. She eats down. Also, I started watching this new show called Britches on Amazon Prime. Girl, it's good. It's about, like, it's a tricky one if you don't want to watch what it's about. Fast forward, but I ain't that far into it, so don't nobody in the comments tell me either. But literally, I'm on season one, like, episode two. Basically, it's about this man worth a lot of money. He dies. He never took care of his first set of kids, but he had a second set of kids with his wife, and he becomes a billionaire rich. So he don't really leave his wife much, but like 20K, and she was complaining about it. But that's not, I guess, a lot compared to what he is worth. So he let his kids have a business, but it's, it's crazy because they kind of beefing, but it's good. Mm-hmm. General Toast? Yes, ma'am. Mm-hmm. Okay. Hey, y'all. So let me tell you something. Let me say something to y'all. <sighs> Girl, why last? Okay. So, y'all know I just got my hair done yesterday. I literally woke up this morning and I had, I, well, last night I took a shower. So I put my shower cap on. Put my shower cap on as a body. I always do this. So, why last night I went to bed and I was like, freak it. I'm just leaving my shower cap on. I'm gonna do my shower cap on. I'm not gonna trip. Went to sleep, left the shower cap on, and woke up like this. Girl, it made my whole head revert. Except, except, Oh my god I couldn't even, you know you get mad about something I couldn't even get mad about it because it really was me cause why would you ever leave your shower cap on like that number two and it let me know I didn't know I was that sweaty when I go to sleep and here I am thinking oh you about to take your tip <laughs> what Baby, what? <laughs> Baby, what? Oh, okay, you do the bath. So, I don't know if the girl's even gonna be able to do my hair today at all. I'm not even concerned with that. I have to go drop my truck off to get service, so I'm about to get my truck and do just that. Um, yeah. Slam all this up in my bag. Ugh. Cause what is it to say? Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna see y'all later. Because I can't believe. Ah! Ah! Mm mm. Mess. Girl, now I'm in a new web. Baby, they done put me in a new web because number one, they said they gotta keep the wagon. They gotta keep the wagon for a couple days. Because I was supposed to be getting this service, but I guess because it's going to take so long, it'll run into the end of business day. So it'll go into the weekend, but child period. But guess where I'm at? I'm at McDonald's. I do not eat at McDonald's at all. I'm just here to support my girl, Cardi. Cardi B. Y'all know her. Hello? Oh, so I'm just here to support my girl, Cardi B. Y'all know I love her. I love Nikki too. I just want to make it clear because I know y'all be tripping. But I, every time it's something like this, I buy music, buy the food, buy the merch. Like, I'm I'm a supporter. You know what I'm saying? Like, I love. So, I do not eat McDonald's. Y'all know I don't eat McDonald's at all. But I just want to get the cute Cardi B cup and maybe a little fry. But I'm not going to probably eat it. Because I don't eat. I don't eat it. But we're going to see. Yeah, I'll probably get a little fry and give it the moon. Give it the denim. Because this ain't my lane, baby. But all I'm needing is you.
Okay, hold on. Right Honey, I asked her what was in the Cardi meal, and she was like, I ain't sure, but we don't got it. Now they selling out shows. I love it. I love to see it. But I'm a, I'll go to another. Well, I'm not going to go to another McDonald's right now. Heck no. But I will go to another McDonald's if I see one in passing. But yes, y'all. I'm super excited. But now I'm on my way home because I got a lot of stuff from Home Depot. And you are going to hit this car. Now I'm on my way home. Girl, he literally backed his ass up because he knew. But now I'm on my way. No, because I'm sitting here at the light. And this guy just pulled out. And I'm looking at him like, honey, this is a loaner car. This ain't my whip. So if you're going to tap it, that's going to be a mess. But girl, he was pulled in the road and everything in that little white van. And I looked. That's why I was like, you about to hit this car. And if you hit it, I'm going to have to call the man because, shoot. I ain't got no remorse. This ain't my vehicle. So, you know, I'm just gonna ride this for the weekend, be cute, you know, drive. <laughs> Y'all like, girl, shut up. I am, I really am. But now, I'm gonna see how I wanna get back to the house. That's what I'm gonna do. Adios, amigos. Hello, everybody. <laughs> my outfit look the freak crazy, I know. I definitely know. So let me tell y'all, what I'm doing today. So, remember, remember I told y'all I had got these little things. Well, I went ahead and taped them up because I'm going to do something with them. I'm pretty much going to make like plastered artwork. So I went and bought like plaster of Paris dry mix. I don't know, we will to see. And then pretty much, I got this bucket over here that I already put water in. And then I'm going to stir it around. I also bought this, which is like paint. Little paint. So I'm gonna take this off. Okay. Definitely need more than this. too much water because it is not thickening up. I'm going to have to dump some of this water out or put it in another bucket. Hold on. Okay, now the consistency is changing. So I had to dump some of that out. So I got to work quick because I think they say if you don't, it'll drop on you. And what we don't want is that. Do a picture. Hey Google, connect to my Spotify.
Brenda the better. So let me tell y'all, we out here cutting the wood. I done learned how to do it. These my safety goggles. Teron is here. Without no safety goggles. You want some goggles? Uh-uh. <laughs> Keep it safe. One thing about it, I'm gonna work it. I'm gonna work in peace. Okay. Oh, I need to turn it this way. Okay. <laughs> Look at your damn safety goggles. Ooh, okay. We gotta slide her back this way because we do it this way. Yeah. I need space to do what I need to do. So which one you what side are you doing? This side. So what I think what you think if I do if I just measure it across the whole thing? You know what I'm saying? You know how instead of doing it the other way, I measure it like each piece. So I'm gonna measure it right here. Like for each one. Cause see the problem is I can't see on this end. What you think? I can see it. Feedback. I don't wanna get my wood up there in this old spot. Right there. Didn't you see that? It looks straighter though, don't it? Yeah. It does. Oh my. This is the last one. We've been doing so good. These hoes could never. Anybody need a house built? Come to me. Brenda the Builder. Period. Up. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna shut the up now. <laughs> We're done. Done. morning yes for already using the wood visuals <laughs> but y'all good morning i feel like really good i woke up at 7 a.m already took dinner mile fed her took a shower and now i'm about to do my makeup because i got a lot of videos to film today so i was like you know what? let me just go ahead get in front of the camera um so that's what i'm doing right now is just film my youtube videos so the girls got something to look at, watch, and eat on a base on a regular basis, and that's on period. I really want this to stay up here like that because that will give me the best lighting ever. And it show did. So that's really what I'm doing right now with my makeup. Literally doing my makeup. I need to go buy me some more brow pencils because all my brow pencils is over with. 
I was like, what is that noise? It's dead. I'm taking a drink. So, that is all I'm doing is my makeup. I'll probably come back on here later with some something to chat about. But, oh, I do know what I wanted to chat about. So, do y'all know Olivia Song? And she was Ari's makeup artist from before. Then she started doing like a lot of celebrity makeup, like Little Kim, um, like just a lot of people that's in the industry. Girl, have y'all been seeing the posts that she's been making lately? Referring to like the Illuminati and all other kinds of stuff. Now, don't get me wrong, I definitely believe the Illuminati is real, but people is pissed at her, and everybody's calling her crazy. Now, I don't know if something like mental went down with her or she really just had a spiritual awakening. Like, I really don't know because I don't know. But they said for weeks she has just been posting like repetitive messages. But I just wanted to know what y'all felt about the whole situation. Because to me, y'all know we like to talk about little events and stuff. And child, I just was like, girl. Sometimes it ain't what you say. I guess it's your delivery and message behind it. If people really can absorb what you're saying. Even with me, I had to learn it myself. But what do y'all feel about that? It's like some people saying that she's like really not all there. And then some people are saying like she is 100% there. It's just, I guess she just delivered her messages. I was really looking into it, but you know what I mean? I can't dig that deep into, like, rabbit hole things. Especially if it really don't pertain to me. Because at the end of the day, I'm the type of person, I'd be like, oh, I can't talk about it no more. I'm over this. I'm wearing out. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, I just want to know what y'all thought about that. Because I was really getting into that. And I'm like, oh, my God. But, like I said, I had to pull back. Because I was like, child, it's too much for me. So much. Also, y'all said y'all really love, but yeah, just let me know. Also, y'all said y'all really love my Dior. Makeup. And thank you, because I was really trying to get it right. And let me tell you, my Amazon link, check it now. Everybody was asking about the light. Y'all was asking about, what else was y'all asking about? The light. A lot of little gadgets I've been using. So definitely please check. Because they're very much so gay. Okay, here's my. But I bet. Hey, what are you doing? How are you this morning? Sit down. Let me see your face. Ooh, your face looks crazy. So basically, I finished my makeup, but now my eye literally started watering, so I have to fix that. And I'm about to like curl my hair real quick, just in some little curls. Um, cause y'all know I'm gonna get. Boy, well, y'all don't know. Ah, oops. Hold on. I'm gonna be going to get my hair fixed tomorrow. Because y'all remember I messed it up. So, I had to make another appointment to get my hair fixed. But that's pretty much all I got going on right now. And then I'm about to finish my YouTube videos for the day. I don't really care for my hair. I'm not even going to hold you guys. But I think the problem is like, um, I had to film today. And then I didn't want to put no baby hairs on it. I'm like, I just... Didn't feel like doing no thing on baby hairs. Um, my little fake baby. Well, I couldn't do my real baby hairs. Hold on. I couldn't do my real baby hairs because, for the simple fact, I don't want to put no gel on them because I'm about to get my hair done tomorrow. And then I couldn't do my fake baby hairs because I really just felt like I didn't feel like doing it today and I wanted to just get the feeling. So, this is what I came up with. 
like a little top knot bun because the front middle look crazy. But I think it should work. Like, honestly, at the end of the day, it should work. But my problem is I don't really have a holding spray. I only have like a moisture barrier, which is a firm hold for frizz ease. But this ain't. I don't know. We're gonna try it today. <sighs> Cause I've been trying to find some products that work really good on my natural hair. Whew. But yeah, this is what I came up with. So why this morning? I was like, you know what? Let me try to watch other YouTubers. I feel like that'd be like a cool thing for me to do. Because I normally don't. So I started with one YouTuber today and it was Peyton Charles. I don't really watch YouTubers, but she came up on my um, homepage and I was watching her vlog and actually it was pretty interesting. So I think I'm gonna make it my business to really try to like look at other YouTubers because I normally don't just to see like I don't know, I guess to get into other influencers, see what other people are doing because with me, I told y'all I really do not watch YouTubers and I haven't had the best relationship with making friends with other influencers. So I feel like I ain't really I'm just watching. I don't I just wanna be a viewer. <laughs> because baby Y'all know how that go. But nonetheless, her vlog was like super interesting. And I was shocked because Sometimes people don't keep my attention, but she really got my attention. And my homeboy Mel had been telling me, he was like, you need to watch Peyton. And I was like, you know I don't watch YouTubers, so that's a no-go. And boom, I watched it and I was like super duper entertained. So I was like, oh my God, this was actually like a good vlog. But yeah. I don't know. Is my well, is y'all as well my fellow influencers? Cause I know the viewers they y'all watch YouTubers because clearly y'all watch me. But like other influencers, do y'all watch other influencers? The influencers watching this, do y'all watch other influencers? Because I know with me, I really don't. <laughs> but I was like, you know, let me try something new. Cause I do watch like a little I would watch like a little handful if people got stuff going on, but I don't have like a consistent Oh, yes, girl. I'm chiming in. She just dropped the video. I don't really have that. I used to, but not no more. So, okay. I don't know what this hair is doing. I put this curl in, and she acted like she want to stay, but then she acted like she want to be crazy. So, who knows? But I'm about to blend this eye in. And then set it, and then be on my way. I just canceled my filming day. <laughs> I really did. And I'm going to tell you why. Because I feel like that hairstyle I had, I wasn't really happy with it. And then it translated on camera a little bit. And then even now, I took it down and my hair is so puffed up. And I want to press it. I do. Because I can get a video done. But then I don't want to put double heat on my hair. Because tomorrow I'm supposed to get my hair repressed. So I have just came to the conclusion that... I will definitely not be filming today. I'm going to film one video that I'm able to film, but other than that, I'm not I'm not filming. Like I'm just not because I don't feel comfortable filming. And y'all probably like, "Girl, you are overreacting." I might just be, but I ain't going to hold you. I don't like the look. Like the look ain't looking to me. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, fill this intro and outro for another thing I have to do. And it's going to work on that because it's just going to work. But I'm about to change my shirt and everything. And nobody will even have a freaking clue because I can't do it. I just can't do it. Like... It just doesn't look like what I wanted it to look like. You know what I'm saying? Like with me talking, I'm literally going to be 
thinking about what I look like the entire time. So I'm just going to not film. Um, like I've been making calls like that on a regular basis too. If something's like not up, oh baby, you won't get me to film nothing. Like I'll be good off filming for sure, for sure. But we're going to see. Oh my God, I hate that that had to happen, but it really did because I just was not happy. I didn't like the look. Definitely didn't like it. So, okay, I'll be back. But look at my hair now. It looks better, but still isn't where I want it to be. It's just kind of big. I don't know. Maybe I'm in my head. Y'all probably gonna be like, girl, you look fine. But no, it's just like, I, like even, now, it's like certain angles, it look good big, but in certain angles, it don't. But I just don't want to redouble press my hair. I just don't. Cause I feel like that's going to like be worse. First off, <laughs> y'all know what this can turn into? A Sunday reset. Cause at this point, I just don't want to do the video. Like I'm going to do it tomorrow. And the thing about me is I really, I'm not no bluffer. So I really will sit up and do the video tomorrow. It's just today I'm just not. So I was thinking of things I could do. Um, what do I want to do? So I probably need to go grocery shopping. That is a thing that needs to be on my list. I also need to go to Ashley Furniture. So I'll definitely probably make that on my list. Is these some of my curls? Okay. I'm trying to make sure all my stuff is safe. Let me put this in here first. So, yeah, I'm going to go do that. I need to order some stuff offline. And. I can't think of right, nothing else right this moment. But at least I know what I'm going to film tomorrow because. I don't have a problem with filming it. It's just, I gotta be on point. I don't be just getting on front of the camera and being like, oh, look, look. No, that's not me. I gotta really be like into what I'm about to film and fill the part. So. And then I also need to go to the makeup store and re up some of my makeup as far as like my eyebrow pencil. My eyebrow pencils. Um. My eyeliner pencil. Other things. So I probably work on that today too. And then my best friend said he was cooking. I don't know how serious he was, but if he was serious, um, we probably would be there as well. Oh shoot. Oh, and then I need to give Denim a bath. Denim needs a bath today too. She does need a bath. Y'all, Denim been getting in trouble all week. She literally. Somebody had asked me, like, how did she like the new house? Girl, she didn't. At, well, I don't know how she feels now. But at first, she did not. She was, like, walking down the steps. She kept falling down the steps. So I was like, dang, I got to figure out, like, something about that. So we fixed that solution of her falling. Literally, she would, like, walk down the first flight and be cool. But in that little second leg, oh, my gosh, she would just, like, tumble that down. It was so sad. So I don't think she liked it then. And then, like, um... She started like, I, I don't know. I think she was just scared. So she kept like going under stuff. I'm like, oh no. So I had to kind of break her out of that. So now I think she's at a place where she's like happier with the environment. I hope. Because I literally did not know what to do. I was like, oh my God, she hate our new house. And I mean, she, if anybody should like it, it should be us. But I think now she's way better. I think she's definitely way better and more happier. So we'll see. It's I'm back. Okay, girl, I didn't clip my hair. So basically, this is my room in the nighttime. Y'all know, don't pay attention to the bed. But this is the room, what it looks like in the night. In the daytime looks super good super super good i just need to get like some type of um black paint so i can paint these 
Because I don't want them to be like showing like that. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay. Like all these look really good. So. Yeah. They look really good. I love the way it looks. It's giving me very much Tulum, Mexico. It gives me the vibes. Also, ended up hanging up this mirror last night. So I thought that looks super good. Gotta find me a floor lamp that I love. And here's the way I look in this mirror. Probably gonna replace this one too. But um, yeah, I've really liked the room so far. I think that it is doing exactly what it's supposed to do. It's superseding my expectations. And yeah, I just gotta get a couple of things. I have to get stuff for like this area, um, floor lamp. I have to figure out what I'm gonna do with my end tables on the sides. And yeah, we're just moving right along. So I love that for me, but I'm about to make a list real quick with my phone so I can figure some stuff out. I was about to do this, I think I'm just supposed to pull them off. Actually, I probably can. But I'm doing this outside because I do not want this to go everywhere. Okay. It's already expanding. So I need to take this off. I don't ultimately know if these were a fail or a success because they literally started like falling apart. But in all good reality, they still look good. I just kind of wanted them to give, oops. I just wanted them to give really like a textured look. Um, I didn't really have any type of specific design in mind but yeah it ended up working so I need to figure out where I want to hang these in my room Ugh. So this is what it looks like. Like a textured wall. I don't know though. I'm still up in the air of like, do I really like it? But I wanna see how it fits in the room before I just be like, ah, I hate it. Okay. But this stuff, you, Things they don't tell you about doing your own DIY canvas art is, is super like flaky. So it won't come off. So I recommend, ah! recommend if you do it, you should seal it with something, you know? Because then that way it'll be like very textured. So here's another one I made. I don't know, we are gonna see what all these really even give. Cause if they give in boo-boo, then they will not be going in that room. I feel like I got great hope though. And if not, something else I was thinking I could do is make it a picture frame. So like, just put the picture in the middle of it. Any type of picture though. Okay. Okay, here it is. 
days. So, I'm gonna take these upstairs and see if they even look good. And if not, then they just won't be making the cut. But if they do, they will be making the cut. And that's on what period. If y'all ever seen me in person in that other car, y'all would be like, child, what is this? <laughs> I mean, but I love that car. I ain't gonna hold you because that was like my first car that I bought myself like luxury and I was very proud of because all my other cars was like, girl, I'm just bopping around and beating around in them. You know what I'm saying? But I really do like this car. So I don't know. We'll see. Oh, and also somebody was talking about this, my temporary tattoo. So y'all know I got this little temporary tattoo and it's supposed to basically remove itself within nine months. Girl, we was on like six months on on seven and she's still present. So I was like, what if she really stay and don't go away? Because at that point, I'm just gonna have to, um, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Maybe get a sleeve at that point. Yeah, because I mean, this is a cute tattoo, but don't get me wrong. It was never given like rest of my life. It was given like right now. So we'll see. Also, I want to shout out Elante for the brand Elante for giving me this hat. Because, girl, she definitely came through and helped me out. Because, child, y'all know what the hair was giving underneath here. So I was like, let me change my outfit real quick to go out in the streets. Because I have to run some errands. But, yeah, shout out to them. I will link it in the bio. But I love this hat. They got another one on. They gave me Atlanta. Honey, I got an Atlanta hat on. Can y'all believe it? Your girl's an Atlanta girl. And it's really showing. <laughs> I'm an Atlanta girl now, baby. So... That's what we got going on right now. But, yeah, I'm on my way right now to Ashley Furniture's to get me a mattress. And then once I get my mattress, I'm probably going to go to Target. And I'm also most likely going to run to um, Hobby Lobby. Those are like my, my trio stores. And then I need to go to Trader Joe's because I want to get something out of there. But I'm really just trying to figure out right now, like, I want to finish my bedroom so I can move on to another room. Because the way I kept telling myself is once I finish room, this room, I'm going to go into the next room. I'm not a person that likes to start multiple tasks. So I wouldn't do like, all, I wouldn't have myself doing three to four rooms at one time. Like, no, I'm really going to finish this room, move on to my next room. Finish this room, move on to my next room. So that's kind of how I've been doing my rooms and it's been working out really well. But I guess I'll see y'all when I get there and like trial furnitures and stuff because baby, it's given. I got to get on a bed. <laughs> You know, I can't be knocking my head against no uh, air mattress no more. <laughs> I'm serious. Like, child, mm -mm. I'm over it. I'm really over it. But, all right, I'm going to see y'all later. Bye, y'all. I'm trying to see what mattress fits the best. We need prices. This one, sometimes I wish somebody was back here. Getting them under is helping me. This one feels pretty good. So now I got me a bunch of gent down, but I don't know if it's gonna fit. I'm in Target and it's super affordable. So we're gonna see them try some of these on and see if they work out. This jacket is like a size small. Um, it's cute, but I don't know if the arms look like it's too small for me. You know, but overall, I do like it in a sense. Um, but I don't know if I like them as they get it. Because I really am sick of my other jackets. I have so many denim jackets. So dry. And then I had a black one. This one's a lot bigger. this one and I like the fact it's a dark color just in case if anything tries to mishap with it from medium but it fit like a large 
I don't think it's cute though. But well, I think that's small in this. I think. Yeah, I know. So basically, I didn't really see nothing in there. I was looking for more like homesy stuff. Uh, sometimes Target's hit or miss, it depends. I went to the one in Buckhead area, so I do actually like this one. It just really wasn't nothing in there today. Maybe it was the day I chose to go, because it is Sunday. But I did get a few of the clothing items. I got the denim um, pants, but I didn't even show y'all them, I forgot. But yeah. So now I'm about to go to Publix and then do my grocery shopping. And then after that, I'm gonna go on to my best friend's house and then take my ass home. So, one moment. Good morning, y'all. Good morning. So I just woke up, I took dinner to the bathroom already because I typically like to get up early. I've been training myself to get up early. Like, cause I'm sick of waking up late. So basically what I do is I put one alarm at 6.45, one alarm at like 6.50, and then the next one at like 6.55. And then basically that'll have me up like by seven. You know what I'm saying? So, yes. But today I wanted to, I've been making for breakfast the same old, same old, like, I ain't even gonna hold y'all. I literally been just kind of low-key eating the same stuff. So, what I now want to do is eat something a little, what is that? Eat some, just eat my um turkey bacon. Because lately, what have I been eating? I've been eating like a lot of, um. I've been eating like a lot of, um, what have I been eating for breakfast? Well, shoot, I guess I really haven't been eating breakfast. I was eating some for breakfast. I think I was just eating cream cheese and a bagel. But no, this morning I'm actually gonna try to make something. I'm gonna get dressed and then I'm going to head out. Cause I gotta go to the store. Girl, they still ain't calling me my truck, so I don't know what's happening with that. Okay. The bacon I be eating is this. Uncured turkey bacon is so freaking good. Like, I love it so much. But I think it's my first time trying this. It's a public spread, because I know when to get, like, um, I know when to get that other bread. I think it's Trader Joe's. And then I started. If I can find it, oh my God, I can show y'all what I started cooking. And I absolutely love it. That is so Girl, look what I cook in. A little teeny pan. And I ended up getting that from Publix one day when I randomly seen it. But since I like to eat bagels, it's perfect. Like literally, so perfect. So I'll put that in the bag. Okay, let me see. Y'all, so I ended up not doing my bagel because I only realized I had blueberry bagels. So at that point, I am just gonna do the egg. And the bacon. It's a wrap. Here, dinner. It's a wrap for you, bang, bang. Be gone. So I got turkey bacon, two eggs, blueberry bagel, only the half, and 
a little lime lime egg drink very much gave period okay so here's my plate i decided to sit here which i normally don't but i want to today Tasty. I'm gonna talk about it. I already had literally tried a little bit of it. It ain't good as the one from Trader Joe's. But she alright. Like it'll do. It ain't like bad. I just prefer the one from Trader Joe's. Mm, 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 mm. So basically, I'm doing my makeup. I literally just woke up, but now I'm doing my makeup because I really need to get this video out. And I, for some reason, just have not been able to do it. Like, it don't matter what I do on my power, but that video just don't be getting uploaded. So, um, where is the other thing on my chocolate? Okay, so... Girl, let me tell you, last night I did not come back on the camera, but I had like two tragedies. <laughs> so, number one, well, number one, I didn't come back. And my best friend, he actually ended up cooking food. He cooked meatloaf. What did he cook? Meatloaf, baked beans, macaroni and cheese. And it was so good. It was so freaking good. Oh, it was so good. So, I guess I should have recorded myself going over there, but I really didn't. And then after that, after um, after I went over there, got my food and stuff, I went to the grocery store. But I really couldn't record at that point because my freaking, um, what is it? My dad one <sighs> vlogging camera had died. And it's crazy, I got like four or five batteries and girl, it had nerded in the BND. So that didn't work. So then after that, Came home, emptied my groceries. So for the first time, I actually ended up using my jetted tub. When I tell you, I clean. Y'all kept telling me, you was like, Tay, don't use the tub until it's clean. Don't use the tub. So I ended up getting it fixed. I had to pay the maintenance guy or some guy like, like only $500. Because somebody else I had called, they literally said it was going to be $250 for them to just come out. Uh, and then whatever they was going to charge on top of that. But this guy only charged me $500 all together for everything. And he had to make two business because he had to buy a park. So, cool. Had a great time. So, he did it. When I tell you I had to take the little jets off the tub, baby, when I say I was cleaning them things, and y'all had told me, everybody kept saying, don't get it. I'm glad y'all said it, though, because I would have cleaned it anyway, but I never knew about, like, jetted tubs to know, like, you have to thoroughly clean it. So... Girl, when I tell you, I was cleaning, cleaning, like, bust down cleaning. I was like, oh, my gosh. Like, I didn't know this thing could be this dirty. So, I cleaned it, like, maybe four times, bleach, everything. Like, just kept cleaning it, kept running the tub. I had to wait till it was fixed, though, to really clean it. Otherwise, I would have been cleaned it. So, I finally got to clean it. So, last night, I was like, okay, I'm going to use it. Where did I'm going? Last night, I said, I'm going to use it. Girl that thing ain't no joke okay it ain't no joke and so i cleaned the jetted tub but the gag is when i put the nozzles back on i guess i had them all like facing up because you know you can kind of direct the direction you want it to be in girl why am i behind literally <laughs> i said i'm a nutcase um also, the door, foundation, very much so hitting. Okay, period. Girl, why in the heck? I'm about to get in the tub. I put the bubble bath in there, and I said, okay, let me um turn the jets on. Because one thing about them jets, they definitely get your, like, tub super bubbly. Like, super bubbly. Baby, I put them jets on, and they literally splash to the back of my window like i mean back of my mirror so y'all know my mirror is like on this side so the tub is on this side so the jets were facing up all that high pressure water just shot straight out 
at my mirror. I was like, what in the mm. girl? It was a hot mess, like hot mess, hot mess. So literally it all, they all sprayed out and, um, girl, it went everywhere. Like <laughs> it went freaking everywhere. So then I had, and then with me, I normally react great in situations. Girl, I ain't reacting none. Nobody's great because literally as soon as it was splashing out, I just was like, I was like, <gasps> and then I freaking reacted like delayed as heck. I'm like, girl, get it together. Like, what are you doing? So nonetheless, I ended up getting that taken care of. And then I had to clean that up because it was water everywhere. All over my sink, all over my pompous grass, all over everything. So... That's fixed now. I thought I was like, what in the world? Like it was a hot mess. So, um, yeah, I got that fixed. But when I say I got in that jetted tub, I guess I needed that because once I got out the tub, baby, I edited my pictures. Got took some pictures yesterday with my hat on. Super cute. Go go like them on Instagram. Baby, why I literally got on the couch and fell asleep to the point where when I leave, I turn my heat off. I came back heat. When I came back, I forgot to put the heat on because I was moving around. So when I got out of the tub, normally I'll just be like, oh, okay, let me put the heat on because I'm about to sleep. I got on my couch, didn't even mean to fall asleep on my couch. And was knocked out. Literally. I gotta blow her out today. Say hello. Say hey, aunties and uncles. Are you Hello. Okay, so I just finished getting my hair done. It turned out super cute, the way it's supposed to look. Baby, it's a hot day in the A. You hear me? It is spicy. It's giving very much so 76 degrees, and I ain't used to it. So right now, I have to go back to my house. Well, I went to DHL because they lost one of my packages. Apparently, my post office don't be wanting to accept DHL and don't tell me y'all because I know what you're gonna say write the address fully out I did write the address fully out of the particular mailbox but they just don't be oh my god they just don't be on it so now I'm on my way back to my house because I went to DHL and they have it so I'm gonna go in my house clean up my house a little bit and probably cook me some food I'm, I'm super hungry I want like some Baby, I want me some chicken tenders. But I gotta get on my workout stuff because, baby, I got a bunch of trips coming up and I gotta lose like 15 pounds all in my stomach. <laughs> I'm gonna lose 15 pounds and, you know, I'm trying to get my arms down. I'm trying to get sexy. I'm trying to get, well, I'm already sexy and fine. I'm trying to get finer. So that's what I've been working on. But I'm about to go home and really like getting my bag of doing my stuff because oh she ain't really got flipped because this is a whole mess whole entire mess but yeah I'm gonna call y'all she like a she want me to spank ma'am I have your shipment you want to come pick it up yes what is the address 20 some minutes. Ugh, disgusted. Okay, I'll see y'all.